because ACT UP had no, had not <laughs> discussed it with us, once we were on the stage, nobody knew what to do, right? <laughs> there was no plan, like no plan A, no plan B, just no plan at all. Um, <laughs> just shouting, <laughs> waving a fist at this audience that was like coming in for the conference who didn't know what the hell was going on. And they'd uh, turned off the mics, uh -huh. right? And so, like it was a huge hall, so they knew that these crazy people shouting something, but nobody knew what, what it were. was. And so then these kind of like negotiations went on. And somehow or other, it was agreed that they would turn on the light, the 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 uh, mics, and let us say our speech, and then we would let them get on with the conference, right? Mm -hmm. um, and I can't remember if I brokered that uh, deal or what was going on, but anyway, as a Canadian person who was supposed to be making the speech outside in Canada, somebody pushed me up, and I thought I had this like ten minute speech, I like no, this mm. not appropriate, right, right. So I just ad libbed it and, and said, you know, on behalf of people with AIDS and HIV, I'm going to open this fifth international conference on 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 AIDS, right?